QEA stands for Quantitative Engineering Analysis. It is a three semester course sequence that all students take in their first three semesters here at Olin. And these provide the fundamental sort of technical background of many of the courses that students go on to take. First year students dive into not only theory, um, of mathematics and linear algebra, but they take these tools and they apply them to real world challenges. And in so doing, we also have conversations around policy, ethics. It's one of the first times in which students are really wrestling with ethics and policy, and that's fundamental to our curriculum. In most schools, you might take a series of mathematics courses, calculus and linear algebra, and then maybe some physics courses and maybe some computer science courses where you learn how to do programming or numerical programming. Here at Olin, we teach all of these together and we do that in the context of engineering from day one. Students um, see the mathematical concepts in practice and they, they learn them not just as some abstract theorem with a rote practice problems, but rather try to understand the concept and apply it in, in different contexts. Some of the desired outcomes from QEA for our students involve thinking critically, communicating effectively, and really coming together and learning to have these tough conversations amongst peers that have different backgrounds, come from different experiences, and understand how to reconcile and navigate some of those tough conversations. One of the first courses students take, and so that's one of the courses where they really learn the Owen spirit of learning, which is working in groups, building a community in the classroom, developing open-ended projects, and not just having a simple problem solution answer, but rather working on much more open-ended work. They develop that, build that confidence to become lifelong learners, apply new concepts to harder engineering problems. Not only the way in which we teach QEA is unique to Olin, but even the material that's contained within QEA is unique. So there's kind of multiple levels of uniqueness, if you will. Um, when I think back to my undergraduate experience, I didn't have the opportunity to see some of this material just on a theoretical level until graduate school. So we take content and we adapt it so that it's accessible and we apply it to real world problems. So for example, when we're learning linear algebra concepts in QEA, instead of focusing on linear algebra in an abstract sense, we learn it in the context of image processing. So students will first do an open-ended project on trying to look at a bunch of images and detect automatically whether the people in the image are smiling. So they build a smile detection algorithm. Then that evolves into more advanced facial recognition software, where they use, again, linear algebra concepts that will be taught in any linear algebra course. But they learn those concepts in the context of building facial recognition software. And along with that, throughout, we discuss the ethics of artificial intelligence and the potential impact of developing technology. I like to think about it as like an apprenticeship style model, not just sitting in a classroom and receiving information one directional, uh, lecture based, but actually getting your hands dirty, being a part of the problem, understanding when issues arise, what they come from. And in this process, we see kind of these lights go off. We see the students become kind of one with the material and really build fundamental understanding. <laughs>